I don't know if it's just me, but some of the cyberspace levels in Sonic Frontiers just look kind of weird. I know they're trying to go for a different direction on how Sonic games can be played, but some of these levels just look entirely too abstract. But before we get too deep into this, please be sure to like, comment, subscribe for more videos like this in the future. I would really appreciate it, but let's get back to the video. Looking at the backgrounds in Sonic Frontiers makes me think about the backgrounds in Sonic Forces where those were probably the best things about each level in Sonic Forces. The backgrounds are so vibrant and there's always something nice to look at, which is strange because the Sonic game, you want to go fast, but in that game you actually can just go slow sometimes and just take in all the stuff that's around you. And I know that sounds counterintuitive because it is a Sonic game, in Sonic you want to go fast, but this is the only game that you can actually go slow and then look at everything around you. But that's not forces enough about that. It seems like a lot of the effort that we're 